We want to share what's an ominous story from Venezuela tonight. Like every other country that has adopted socialism, Venezuela has collapsed inevitably into dire poverty and chaos. Shortages there are universal. Inflation is now in the triple digits. And despite the world's largest oil reserves, that country can't even keep its lights on. Things are so bad that this very moment the country is plunging into civil disorder as thousands of demonstrators clash with security forces of the president there, Nicolas Maduro. But there's another lesson in Venezuela besides the failure of socialism. In 2012, that country banned the private purchase of firearms and ammunition and launched a massive campaign to disarm the civilian population. That wasn't accidental. You can see where this is going. Faced with the demands that he relinquish power and hold free elections there, President Maduro has decided to unleash armed supporters, their guns weren't taken away, on his disarmed populace. On Monday, Maduro announced his plans to expand the country's civil militia from 100,000 to half a million, every member gets a gun. The intent is clear. If he and his cronies can't stay in power forever, they will do so with the force of arms, and the masses who have no guns don't stand a chance. Remember that the next time your liberal friends extol the virtues of a gun-free society.